feel about that lead as they go along? Well, I just thought we played a really solid, solid game. We looked more like a veteran team tonight. Uh, but uh, execution was good. Our pace was good. Uh, I think we had three turnovers, four turnovers in the first half. Uh, but we played solid basketball. A lot of guys played well. And I thought our defense was pretty good. Impressed with Romeo Langford's just readiness and having not played the Yeah, he's done everything from start to not play a minute in other games. He just always seems to be ready no matter what we need. So with Devin out, uh, he did a hell of a job. When you get that kind of scoring for him, that's sort of crazy. Yeah, I think I think he's got that kind of ability. You know, he's just, as you know, been injured. Uh, since he came into the league, you know, off and on, that kind of thing. So he's been pretty healthy for us. You mentioned the defense. It looked like you guys really matched the physicality that Randall brings to the table. Is that how you have to? Well, play? I don't know if we matched his physicality. <laughs> that, would, that would be pretty tough. But uh, I think as a group, uh, we handled the physicality pretty well. We gang rebounded, so to speak. Uh, we went after loose balls, uh, had a big stop at the end. Uh, where the ball ended up on the court, on the floor, and you know we had guys diving for it, so it was a hell of an effort. They deserved to enjoy that win. How do you think you guys are doing on the defending without fouling part of the equation, especially the younger guys? Well, you know they're great with their pump fakes. You get about three or four guys that pump fake all the time, so in that regard, we did pretty well. But uh, we kind of let them back in with, you know, maybe three or four times there in the second half where we got off our feet. And it was three or four different players that were doing it. Uh, but it's a huge discipline for a young player to be able to just stay in front and absorb pump fakes and not foul. Is the fourth quarter uh, emphasized talking point pretty well, like not losing the lead and things like that? Um... Well, it's it's not about, you know, we don't talk about losing a lead or gaining. We talk about being solid. It's a 48-minute game. And you can't just play 36. You have no matter what's happening. If you're not making shots, well, then it puts more pressure on your defense to do well. So uh, it's all a discipline. It, it's a circular kind of thing. Cal Sohan's free throw is looking right now. It's it's great. He's got a lot of guts, a lot of courage to go out there and do it with one hand. Uh, but he's he's knocking them down, and that's what matters. Hey, coach, Belden had those two early fouls, but it seemed like when he came back, he didn't let him. That it game and yeah, you know, that's a good point because, you know, a lot of guys, if they get two quick ones, they're, they're out for the game no matter what. They come in, they're not aggressive, and it just kind of plays with their head. But uh, he showed some good maturity by staying in it and playing at both ends of the court, even though he had those quick fouls. Okay, have a good night.